What's going on guys, Cecil here. So as you guys might already know my Redemption 2 got released to PC finally. But unfortunately there are a lot of troubles that PC players run into while playing this game. One of the biggest troubles is that the game crashes. Of course there is another trouble that the 4K resolution never gets to 60 frames per second but I guess that just because the game has a uh, very high graphics. So just turn the resolution down, this part doesn't matter. But the huge trouble people are running into is the fact that the game crashes once it starts. Here let me show you, so I'll, ju I'll just start the game now. Now as you can see as the game starts right here in this part it will crash right there and it will just stop working and then this error will occur when the redemption 2 exited unexpectedly so basically this error has been happening to a lot of people the game has been crashing to a lot of pc players out there and i understand how frustrating it can get for you to get a brand new game and then the game just doesn't work for you the game keeps crashing all the time so i'll just show you exactly what you need to know in order for you to avoid this crash and enjoy the game so first of all if you have nvidia graphics card you need to make sure that you have updated your driver into the latest one which is version 441.12 it is actually a version that was released specifically for red Dead redemption 2 you can see it right here red Dead redemption 2 that's that's the version i'm not opening the game just it just said red Dead redemption 2 because the version is specified for the game so that's the first thing you need to do now in order for you to upgrade into that driver what you need to do is to get yourself geforce experience and simply click check for updates and it will check for you now if you have not upgraded your driver into that that version which is 441.12 that's specified for Red Redemption 2 it will tell you right here that this version you have not installed and it will just tell you to download it you can choose express installation because that's the that's the better choice and that's it that's basically the first thing you need to make sure of version 441.12 is the one that's specified for Red Redemption 2 or the latest driver whatever you want to call it that's the first thing you need to do to avoid the crash now the second thing you need to do to avoid the crash is to update windows itself all right since I've already updated my windows so I took a screenshot of it so that you will understand what exactly it is where is that specific version now it's actually an optional update which means that it will not automatically update windows for you you'll have to manually do it as version 1903464 i'm 64 bits if you're 32 well i guess you won't be able to play the game in the first place what the hell are you doing with a 32 bit gaming computer but yeah it's version 1903 for 64 bit windows 10 you need to up you need to manually download it because it's an optional update you cannot download it uh, automatically you have to manually do it so let me tell you exactly what you need to do to manually uh download it or manually update windows with that version you just click start and then click windows go to windows update settings you click check for updates now it will check all the updates for you whether the regular updates that you need to uh download and update or the optional updates it will check everything for you and after that it will list the updates right in front of you, you just choose the update you need to download there will be uh, it will require you to restart the computer so do that restart the computer give it its time it will take maybe from 20 to 30 minutes to do the update depends on how fast your computer is and yeah that's basically the second thing you need to do in order for you to be able to uh, play the game without crashing so again that's the specific update that you need to look for in order for you to be able to play the game it's called 19 all three for 64 bit based systems for windows 10 that's it that's the update you click download and install now and that's it you're good to go and that's basically the second thing you need to do uh, to avoid the crash now the third thing you need to do to avoid the crash is to go here and right click your antivirus mine is avast and go to avast shields control or whatever it is for your uh, antivirus mine is avast shields control and then go to disable permanently and okay basically what that does is it turns off your antivirus because for some reason uh, antivirus viruses see the game as a virus or something like that and they do not turn them on or do not work with them hopefully rockstar will be able to solve this problem in uh, future updates or whatever but until now antivirus just completely refuses the game for some reason and yeah these are basically all the steps you need to do to avoid the crash of red redemption 2 and now if we go into red redemption 2 and click play the game will start smoothly with no problems at all so this is the part where it crashes but as you as you can see it doesn't crash it just continues to the game and yeah it'll be better if you play this game with a controller you know gives you a much better experience but yeah as you can see the game started i would actually go and start playing the game but i don't wanna you know start the game and spoil any events for me i'm just you know running through the story i mean i i've already played it before but yeah i don't want to ruin the experience anyways that's basically all you need to do in order for you to avoid red redemption 2 crash now like i said hopefully rockstar will solve these problems in the future but for now do these things i've listed in this video and the crash will be gone for you and you'll be able to play the game and enjoy it all you want if your computer can handle it that is anyways yeah that's all about how to avoid crashes in red redemption 2 and that's all that's what see you guys later bye